So just wanted to make a quick MLB news video for you guys talking about the New York Mets and Corbin Burns as well as Brandon Woodruff uh, and some trade rumors regarding both players. So uh, here on the screen is a tweet from John Morosi who says, as I mentioned on MLB Network, the Mets options now include a overwhelmingly the Brewers on a trade for Burns or Woodruff or B competing for Rodon in an expensive free agent market. Uh, there's actually no mention of Justin Verlander here, but I would throw that into this mix as well. Uh, basically, uh, since Jacob deGrom has left and signed a massive contract with the Texas Rangers, uh, it seems like now the Mets focus is on replacing his production in starting pitching. So uh, that is why it's mentioned that. Uh, and also was reported earlier today that uh, the Milwaukee Brewers have been taking calls on Corbin Burns and Brandon Woodruff, uh, but have been telling teams that those two players are not available. So it seems interesting the timing of this, that they're coming out and saying he's not available, but we're listening to calls. I don't know. Take it for what it's worth. Every man has, every team has a price. And if Corbin Burns or Brandon Woodruff were offered a massive, you know, package for from the from the New York Mets, what are the Brewers going to say? No, like they're going to they're going to do what's best for their franchise. So uh, I think if the Mets really are interested in either one of these players, they could probably make a trade work. But also, as mentioned in the second half of this tweet, Part B, uh, maybe Carlos Rodon is a more realistic option. Now, if they were to strike out in free agency, they could probably explore the tr uh, the trade market once again. So uh, maybe their top priority this year will be to sign one of Carlos Rodon or Justin Verlander. Uh, but if those don't work out, maybe they shift their attention towards the trade market. Market and talk to the Milwaukee Brewers, who should be a rebuilding team anyways, uh, for a player like Corbin Burns or Brandon Woodruff and what the price for those players may exactly be. So I will keep an eye on the New York Mets uh, this offseason as, uh, you know, Justin Verlander, Carlos Rodon are some players available uh, and Jacob deGrom is now a Texas Rangers. So it seems like they could be in the market for a pitcher. Is that through the trademark or is that through free agency? I guess only time will tell. Leave your thoughts down below as always. Thanks again for watching and see you in the next one.